Hello, everybody. Arjun here. Let's play some more Victoria 3. Uh, the new DLC, Voice of the People, just came out. Uh, it adds a bunch of more political things, and it concentrates a lot on France. So I'm gonna actually do just that. We're gonna play as France. I actually haven't played since right before 1.2 came out. So there's a bunch of new mechanics I'm going to have to explore. Okay, so France, rank number two. We have 187 battalions, 80 fleet, GDP 23.6, uh, uh, Prestige 842, so quite a bit behind Great Britain. Okay, well, let's begin. Okay, uh, what? What is going on with our laws? Yeah, they changed quite a bit. Now you can have agitators. That you can actually invite to your country. Uh, and they help you pass different laws. He's a radical in intelligentsia. So I guess you can use them to encourage a passing of any of the laws that are in green. I'm not sure. Kinda explore this together. Uh, so we have a monarchy, wealth voting. Single party state. Uh, universal suffrage is probably the goal. Ooh. Uh, let's take a look. What is our government? Resistance party. Landowners, armed forces, Catholic Church, and industrialists. Intelligentsia is being suppressed. Why? This is all kind of different, slightly. No, I don't want to invite Giuseppe Mazzini. A lot of these characters are supposed to be historical individuals. Marginalized. Petite bourgeoisie is actually marginalized in trade unions. I guess petite bourgeoisie, that would be shop owners and... Uh, our king is strongly endorsing monarchy. Who, who could have... Could have <laughs> been surprised by that. Uh, he's a political operator, plus five authority. He's a ruler, plus 20... Improve relationship speed, minus 20 political movement, radicalism. That is actually good. So we're less likely to form radicals. Oh, the game hasn't started yet. We don't have, we have zero loyalists and zero, uh, uh, zero radicals and zero loyalists. Let's pick a technology. Uh, 
Not sure if I want to go down the military route or industry first. Well, let's take a look what are industries. What level is our industry at? Our standard living is horrible. 9.1? Guess it's above the minimum expected. 6.8. That's not good. Not good at all. We have a lot of textile mills. We have two universities. Oh no, seven, seven universities. We are losing money. That's not good. We have taxes on wine. What else can we tax real quick? Grain? Nope. Ah, uh, liquor. Liquor would actually bring in a lot of money. What about tobacco? Uh, a little bit. I'm gonna hold off on taxing anything else for now. Oops, that's Prussia. So most of our industry is concentrated in textile mills, which is actually not too bad. We have a lot of government administrations. Not all of them. Well, that's the only one. Let's go with standardized. Filing system. We are actually technologically well ahead compared to most other countries I've played as. Uh, coal mine. Or, I mean, steam donkeys are good for mining. How are we doing on mining? Uh, let's change some of these things. Not enough qualified. No, that's okay. We'll find qualified people. Wasting tools. Do we have any tool production? Not really. Okay, let's expand tool production. Because we're gonna need more. Now we can change this. We'll lose money at first. Actually, we're gonna lose a lot of laborers. Uh, people are going to be unhappy. And now we have a fertilizer shortage. That's because we don't produce any. What is... how much are we short by? Uh, well, we don't need any... convoys to get it from Belgium. Let's get that, and that's pretty cheap. 
Mm, Prussian market. Let's do that. Are we exporting anything? Do we have anything we can export? Wheat, I guess. I should unpause this really quick. Uh, our private sector is building another livestock range. Ooh, colonization, that's right. What do we have interest in? I guess that's all we have the power to clear interest in. Okay, let's start colonizing what we can. Yep, everywhere there's malaria, so that's not good. That'll go very slow. That's okay. What's this? Pretenders to the throne. Three dynas uh, dynasties have claimed on the French, or three dynasties have claims on the French throne. The earliest line backs the constitutional July monarchy. Legitimist line supports descendants of Charles X, while the Bonapartist line seeks to restore Napoleonic French Empire. Huh. I wish there was more information. I guess he can pick. Who you want the government to be? Legitimist pretender? Well, let's just stick with King Louis. French Kenya is isolated. What? It's already been colonized? That was quick. Mm. We need... To build our own fertilizer plants. That's what we need to do. Chemical plants. Provence. We have plenty of labor there. Let's put a couple there, a couple here. Let's go three here. Yeah, I haven't played with any of the private construction enabled. That's going to be kind of interesting. Uh, let's take a quick look. What are we producing? We have a few coal mines. Iron mine. I still haven't searched. I am not doing great. Yeah, it's been a couple months since I played this. Uh, let's go with improved fertilizer. Let's do that. So we can actually invest into our farms. What else can we grow? Can we produce silk? 
of our own, or are we importing silk? Are we not using silk for textiles? We are not. No, this says we are. So where is our silk coming from? So we are importing it, okay. Ouch. None of those trade routes are very good. Oh, we can grow our own silk. We have two provinces that actually can produce silk. Um, did I get it wrong? Are we actually exporting it at a negative... Other countries trade routes with France. Okay. We are exporting Fr uh, to Brazil and Switzerland at a loss. Well, that's not good. There. That way we can actually make money. Services, furniture, wine. Clothing. Clothing is actually usually a really good export commodity. Switch to ceramics. The only problem is... We are barely producing enough to supply our own demand. And yeah, right now the market is not that great. Which will increase as more and more people become or start moving into better jobs in other cities and countries. Sorry. I'm going a little bit hoarse. What's going on here? Uh, low standard of living pops from below minimum expecting standard of living. Uh, that's because we need to increase our industry everywhere. Uh, I shouldn't. Let's build another construction center. Let's see what we can build. Food industries. Let's build one here. have really bad standards of living here. We have a lot of extra population. Let's build another tool workshop here. And a textile mill. We're not utilizing trains or anything yet, I don't think. Nope. 
Uh, proposal of trade agreement from Russia. I'm going to decline. Uh, what are our relationship with Great Britain? They do not like us. Let's start again improving relationships. Uh, United States, let's do that here as well. Uh, we can propose a trade agreement with the United States. Hmm, no. We still have issues with lumber. Let's import some. And fabric. Let's import some of that. It's beginning of the game, so there's not a lot of... If tools are still a problem, that should fix it. Iron's gonna be... Uh, let's get more iron mines going. There we go. Kinda spread it around. Probably good. Hmm. We have a lot of places with good soil. Coal mines here produce more. Let's get a coal mine going. Get another wheat farm. Do some more food. Can always export wheat, I believe. Mm. Can't really make that much money. Export it to Brazil. Well, we'll make a tiny amount, but better than nothing. Oh, you are isolated. Let's put port in here. Yeah, beginning of the game is just managing the economy and making sure everything's not failing because the countries don't seem to start out very balanced kindly burn this letter john uh jean d du way sold a prominent member of the resistance party has been accused of gross corruption he strenuously denies all allegations until Damning letters surface against us uh, signed by him. Uh, sorry about my French pronunciations. I... <laughs> Resistance Party. Who is the Resistance Party? Uh, it's one of the ruling parties right now. That's okay. Um, probably wanting get the intelligentsia in so we can start getting oh slavery was banned no migration controls poor laws is there anything we can pass at all property women child labor allowed i would love to change that 
Yeah, we need to get intelligence here in. We have public schools, no health system. We need some kind of health system. Um, we actually might get it passed. There's a lot of undecided who's against it. Industrialists. They will get over it. Probably. Uh, what is referrals? Is this a new mechanic? Oh, you can only have three setbacks? Well, that's much better than it used to be. I've had some laws where it would just spawn the same setback over and over and over until the law just failed. If it's only limited to three, that'd be... We have an election coming up. Uh, projected votes. Resistance party versus... The Republican Union is gonna win. Or no. No, they only have 35%. They have the greatest momentum. But they're not gonna make it. Health taxes. With the calls for some form of healthcare system, many are questioning whether the money for setting up the new healthcare system will come from. Some are suggesting simply taking it out of our tax funds, while others insist the government should find another way to cover the costs. We are going for charity hospitals. That's it comes from charity, right? game what are you talking about mm. plus 20 enactment success chance but I lose a lot of money uh, that's even more money uh, we can get by without it yep Uh, lecture and results, uh, the resistance party won, Republican Union came in, well, very low, 26%. Nope, you are getting a port build, don't worry about it. What is going on, didn't I? Uh, yeah, there we go, construction office. Let's move it to the top, get that built first. Oh, that, that got built quickly. What is our construction iron frame? We haven't gotten to steel frame yet. Free government reform. No, let's at least keep the industrialists in for now. Yeah, that would be great. Everybody is in the government, but that'll give us a legitimacy of 4%. Uh, let's just keep it where it is. What is this? Luxembourg. Ooh, let's check our... Journal. Can we annex anything? National formations? Nope, nothing. Most of our population is in the lower strata. That's... Not good, at least. Our standards of living are slowly going up. That's good, right? Uh, 
Uh, let's check on our construct. Why is it only constructing one thing? Does the private constructions... Does that take it out of my construction queue? I don't like that. So half of my construction queue is going towards... I was kind of hoping they had their own private construction. Oh well. Uh, Charity Hospital has successfully progressed to the drafting paw, a phase of law enactment. Success, 25% chance. Oh, they kind of changed how this happens. Okay. Well, we'll pick up here in the next video. We'll hopefully get that law passed, get our industry going. Well, hopefully the private sector stops stealing my construction queue. Okay. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe, hit that like button. I'll see you all in the next one.